morning, Hoppin' in Middle School, and welcome to HMS Today. I'm your host, Manoli Barris. Today, we'll learn about the 2.62 mile run, the new Leaders Club, and you'll be hunting around the school for the Have You Seen This. We'll spend some time with our principal, Mr. Keller, and we'll hear what you had to say for the question of the day. But first, here's Mrs. Grady with today's announcements. Good morning, Hopkinton Middle School. Today is Friday, March 8th. It is a day 12 and we have X block. Running club will take place on Friday, only in room 249 beginning this week. Girls Robotic Day will take place on April 14th from 2 to 4 in the C-Wing at the high school. There will be games, prizes, snacks, music, mentors, and fun. The application period for school busing for 2016-2017 is now open. The deadline is May 2nd. Monday, April 11th is a day one. Have a happy, happy Hopkinton day. Try your hardest, do your best, and be kind to everyone you meet. Thank you, Mrs. Grady. And now to let us know what else is going on in the school, Mr. Keller is here for a minute with the principal. Unless you're doing makeups, congratulations uh, on making it through the English portion of MCAS testing. We appreciate all of your efforts to do your best you can do on this annual assessment. You'll get a little break and then our MCAS journey takes us to math and science in May. Speaking of journey, did you get to see last Friday's staff talent show? We had a lot of fun and it seemed as though most of you did as well. Thank you so much for coming and supporting our attempts to be talented, but most importantly for supporting our grade 8 students trip to Washington DC. Thanks to Ms. Kirschenbaum for organizing the entire evening. Spring sports are off and running, although the April snow prevented baseball and softball from getting outside. Everybody is still up and running. Mrs. Grady, Mrs. Ben Benick, and I look forward to seeing all of you participating in track, baseball, and softball, taking, play in, taking part in practices and games. Congratulations to our grade 8 band, chorus, and orchestra. Last weekend, they participated in the MICA Festival. Our band earned a silver medal. Chorus earned a bronze and orchestra earned a bronze as well. I'd like to thank Mr. Hay, Mr. Purdy, Ms. McDonald, Mr. Dodge, Ms. Conan, and Ms. O'Toole for all of their outstanding efforts. This weekend, I have the pleasure of attending an award ceremony for Mr. Parker. Mr. Parker is being recognized as the Massachusetts Physical Education Teacher of the Year, which is quite an honor, as you can imagine. Make sure that you congratulate Mr. Parker on this accomplishment. Finally, I'd like to acknowledge our grade six students who submitted their essays on their desire to inspire projects on Athenians defending their homeland. I had the opportunity to read several of the essays and they were outstanding. Well done to all of you. I hope you have a wonderful weekend, which is our last one before April vacation. Thank you very much, Mr. Keller. Now here's Mrs. Vera to tell us about the upcoming 2.62 mile run. Good morning, Hillers. This is Mrs. Vera from the Desire to Inspire Committee. Just wanted to let you know that Tuesday is the day for our big 2.62 Run Walk Challenge. And guess what? You're getting new shirts, so make sure you wear them. Don't worry, you don't need to be the fastest. We're doing this together as a community. But if you do want to race, the winners will get a chance to go to Boston for the wreath ceremony. Encourage your friends, enjoy the outdoors, and move your body. Inspire your friends, your teachers, with your great attitude on Tuesday. Can't wait to see you there. I can't believe it's almost time for the Boston Marathon, and good luck to all of the runners. Now, let's hear about the new Leadership Club, coming to our school. Hello, my name is Randy Herrick, and I'm the Senior Program Director at the Metro West YMCA Family Outdoor Center in Hopkinton. I'm helping to launch a Leaders Club at your school with my lead instructor, Tara Walsh. What is Leaders Club? The YMCA Leaders Club is a community service-based program that helps teens become leaders. Our goal is to challenge teens to serve their community and learn to lead those around them. What happens at Leaders Club? While in Leaders Club, you will work with other teens from your school to build a club that actively engages in your community while also having fun. Members also participate in social events, service projects, and have the opportunity to go on several trips called rallies. When does Leaders Club meet? Leaders Club meets once a week after school on Fridays for one hour. We also meet occasionally on weekends to complete community service projects and go to the Family Outdoor Center for team building activities or to go on overnight rally trips. Who can join Leaders Club? This year we will only be accepting participants in 6th or 7th grade. At the start of the new school year, the group will be open to new 7th and 8th graders. How do I join? Information flyers and applications can be picked up at the main office. Thank you and I hope to see you at our first meeting. Remember to pick up an application at the main office if you want to join. Okay, now it's time for... Why do I keep doing that? Okay, now the time... Oh, it's the time. 
Yep, now's the time. All right. Remember to pick up an application at the main office if you want to join. Okay, now it's the time you've all been waiting for, the question of the day. We wanted to know, what three things do you want more than anything else in life? Three things I want most in life are to go to the Olympics, get more leotards, and work on the, be the uneven bars better. Money, food, and shoes. <laughs> it would be cake, cupcakes, and cats. Three things I would like to have is social media, another dog, and another dog. I would like to have a lightsaber, a million dollars, and a house in the Bahamas. A million dollars, a beach house, and, and more sleep. sleep. <laughs> Life. Liberty. And the pursuit of happiness. And by the way, shout out to Lucas Dunn for donating to the clothing drive, giving us some fresh bronze. Three things that I like more than anything else in the world are family, friends, and freedom. Fam. Question of the day. Home room. Home room. Yeah. Mr. Brennan. Hi, I'm Mr. Purdy, and this is the question of the day. The three things that I would like more than anything else in life are a world that gets along, a great future for my students and my children, and I would also like everyone's rewards to equal the effort that they put in. Food, sleep, and more food. Money, power, and sleep. I like food. Sports and friends. Yeah. I would want to own my own IHOP restaurant. I would like sleeping and free food. Let's go free food. Meh. The first one would be I need a life itself because I don't have any. The second one would be a house. And the third one uh, would be something. Three things that I would like more than anything in my life is a squad and a life and a 2016 Audi R8 Premium Plus V10 Plus Carbon Fiber. Food, money, and food. If I really had to pick, I'd want chicken, bunnies man, and feisty pandas. And now, just so you know, the HMS Robotics Club is heading to Kentucky, but they'll need your help fundraising. If you'd like to donate, go ahead to gofundme.com slash robohillers. If you have any questions, email kwang at hillers.org. And now, here's the answers for the Have You Seen This? It's of the Fovist perspective poster outside of the art room. Congratulations to Kevin Gu, Fiona Medeiros, for finding it. Stop to the main office after school for your prize. Now, here's a new picture for you. If you know where it is, send your answers to HMSTV at Hillers.org, and you could be our next winner. That's all for this week, Middle School, for HMS Today. I'm your host, Manoli Bears. Now get out there and study hard.